Some of Connecticut's smallest critters sticking around thanks to that mild October that we had. Tick season just keeps on going. It's something to keep in mind on days like this when it's warm and beautiful out there and you'll probably want to be outdoors. Yeah, health experts say have some helpful tips to keep those ticks away. We've been telling you about this through the season. News 8's Noelle Gardner explains. We are currently testing only deer tick. Tick season is still going strong in Connecticut. Scientists say ticks will stick around through the winter. If the weather continues the way it has been, we will have early in the season in 2018, we will have the same issue and the same plague of tick activity. Here at the state lab, they're getting in dozens of ticks daily from people all over Connecticut. Researchers are testing for Lyme disease and other tick-borne diseases. All these will be tested and at least one or sometimes two of these will be uh, positive for Lyme disease. Dr. Gudars Mulai says one out of three ticks will carry Lyme disease. And some of these ticks have uh, multiple or dual infection. Snowy days might help ticks survive. During warmer days, snow may even provide additional shelter. At the Central Hospital for Veterinary Medicine, several dogs a week are testing positive for Lyme disease. You're worried about like your dogs bringing it in for your children or for yourself into your home, you know, so there's there's multiple reasons to be nervous about it. When you're apple picking this season or just walking your dog in the park, ticks will be there. Wherever you have rodent activity, wherever you have deer activity, wherever you have leaf litters, wherever you have woodland habitats, ticks will be there. Dr. Mulai says wear light-colored clothing and spray a repellent on your clothes that contains DEET before heading out. Reporting in New Haven, Noel Gardner, News 8.